So hi guys, uh, just a quick video to show you some uh, new factories on the Supreme online tool on uh, the Supreme GPI uh, base build. Uh, so we're gonna go to option menu, then you can see there is Supreme online tool. So you just have to press on this one. Uh, you have to go online uh, on your device, so you have to set the Wi-Fi. Uh, right now it's uh, reach the servers. Just wait and uh, okay so now we are online on the Supreme Online Updater so you can see there is like new factories, uh, there is a new fix and new visual uh, or tweak uh, option. Uh, we are gonna go to visual first. So here we are, so you can install new emulation station theme, you can install new launching image, you can install new video loading screen, and new boot intro splash screen. So we're gonna do it and look uh, how to set it after downloading on the device. So for example, new emulation station theme, you can go to the submenu, and you can see all choice you have. So Game Boy GPI Team, Game Boy Zero, Pixel, Super Retro Boy, or Mini Jow. Uh, just pick the one you want. We're gonna install uh, uh, the Super Retro Boy one. So you just press OK. It's gonna download, as you see, and install. As the download time, depending your internet connection. Uh, so after install, you have to go back to the main menu, press start, then UE setting, and theme set. I don't know if you guys can see it, yeah. And choice, for me, like I have just downloaded Super Retro Boy, so I choose it. I press back, and it's gonna set it on the device. Here we are. If you see some, some missing uh, art, uh, like here, it's just because the theme does not support all system. Uh, this is why we have installed by default Heychromi or Box City by Dwayne Hurst, because uh, he always make uh, really exhausting stuff. Uh, he supports all system. Uh, but if you haven't got any ROMs uh, for system, uh, the theme does not support, it's, done ma it's not matter. So I'm going to change to Acromi. So UE setting, theme set, up, push back. Okay, so we're gonna show over factories. So we go to Supreme Online Tool again. So now we're online. So we go to Visual again. So you can install new launching image. We are going to do it. Uh, it's a SendWave pack. Uh, you have a free pack uh, by default on your device. So it's going to add one more, the SendWave. As always, you just have to push OK. And it's downloading and installing. But uh, for setting it, uh, you have to go to option, uh, visual, and launching image and set it. Uh, we are going to do it uh, in a few minutes if you don't know how. Uh, so it just download and install on the device but it's not set it by default. Okay, over factories is new uh, video loading screen. 
So you can see uh, there is a preview. We have had the uh, Supreme United uh, video loading screen. So you can install it uh, and it's going to be set because there is no menu for a choice uh, from one to another. So if you install it, it's going to make it by default. But you can go back to the Supreme GPI default one by installing here. Uh, and we have add new intro. Um, so you can also see it, install and uninstall it. Uh, for example, the default one on Supreme GPI. The music is a background music. It's not the music from the splash screen. Okay, so that's it for visual, uh, for the fix. It's just um, uh, an easy step for you to change the default core for Sega CD game. Uh, if you don't know how to do it, uh, this script is going to change it for you uh, just by pressing OK. Uh, it's LR Pico drive is really more faster, uh, so you will have better performance, but uh, it does not support uh, CHD uh, ROM file. Uh, so you must have BinQ uh, for use this one, but the performance is uh, really much better. Uh, so we are just going to go to Visual Tour. Uh, so you can see Lochin screen. So loading screen, it's uh, the image we are playing after the video loading screen. Uh, we have just downloaded the SendWave uh, pack. So we are going to set it by default. So install loading screen. You can also remove and download, but I advise to not download them from here because uh, the image size uh, doesn't fit the screen of the device, uh, it is going to be bigger, so uh, it's better to download them by the Supreme Online tool. So for install, you have Pixel by default, uh, you can choose Synthwave, the one we have just downloaded a few minutes ago. Okay, so now it's set. We are going to see what does it look like. Uh, I'm going to launch a SNES game, for example. So you have the Supreme United loading screen, video loading screen, and after the Synthwave launching image. And after the game starts. So that's it, guys. Um, hope you like uh, new victories we have had. Um, if you are a, a makers, if you have uh, uh, create some art, some boot intro, some theme or whatever, uh, just uh, contact them if you want uh, the art or the stuff you have make uh, to be on the Supreme Online Tour. Uh, so you can just uh, leave a comment on this video or join the Supreme Retro Gaming Facebook group uh, and uh, ask them. Uh, you will be welcome. So uh, thanks for watching and see you guys soon. Bye.